Hey everybody, up here in the uh, hills I found something beside this tree. There's an abandoned farm in the background. Yes, that's an abandoned farm. One of the most intriguing. I've been eyeballing it for uh, nearly a decade. But uh, what I want to show you now is this uh, old ceramic vessel here. It's been parked here at the side of the road for the longest time. <laughs> I thought I'd better give it some attention. Well, we see it when I come by here. These uh, big ceramic vessels are, uh, have a lot of uses in Japanese culture from way back. I admire the uh, craftsmanship and the beauty, the durability of them, despite the fact that this one has been broken. Usually they'll have um, a thicket on the, on the bottom somewhere, a hole where you can, uh, the contents can be accessed. Let's see if we can lift it up a little bit, take a look what you can find. The bottom, nice and wet. Swirls of the ceramic there. Aha. There it is. So a little uh, spigot would have come out of there in some capacity to allow the uh, fluids to be removed. Very heavy. Let's see inside. It's got some water down inside there. Leaves and like broken. The upper half is all gone. There's a crack along the edge here. A little bit of a... Put it back the way we found it. A little bit of a abandoned Japanese uh, craftsmanship by the side of the road. Way, way up in the mountains. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.